When Nicole and Casey had their long-awaited firstborn, Teddy, they were overjoyed. But Casey is also a little anxious about a surprise he had in store. I was very nervous. <laughs> it felt like I was proposing to Nicole. It felt like, you know, yeah. all those moments where I, you know, get those butterflies. After years of infertility, Teddy's arrival was a dream come true. And Casey wanted to show his feelings with a gift from the heart. You hear about women getting push presents and, you know, they, they get these extravagant, expensive gifts. But I feel like this is something that um, just takes it to like a whole nother level. Casey had written a story for Teddy explaining his mom and dad's journey from sweethearts to parenthood. I was trying to find the right moment and, you know, we were sitting there late at night. That, putting him to sleep. Putting him to sleep and... And he asked me if, if I wanted to read him a bedtime story. Yeah. And just... I was like, I don't have baby books like here Sorry. with me. Um, <laughs> I showed her like, I've got this book. It's oh, not I here thought... yet, but here's the digital copy. Dear Teddy, have I got a story for you. It's about a loving pair of carrying bears that lived inside the zoo. They love two things in this world, each other and the thought of you. They prayed for a cub each day, like a jelly to a kangaroo. <laughs> but the zoo had no more cubs, which gave the pair a scare. Every year that went on by, they felt like they were ready. So they went out on their own one day, looking for a teddy. Pouring rain, dangerous cliffs, a giant waterfall, raging rivers, sleeting snow, and mighty gusty squall. While their journey together was painfully long, their undeniable love and hope for a cub was equally strong. Nicole and Casey's story began in high school. We met junior year in one of our, I think it was like a college prep class. We were, you know, in class together probably a whole semester before I asked Nicole out. Went on a couple dates, ended up asking her to be my girlfriend. The couple kept dating throughout college. Shortly after, Casey popped the question. And aside from a ring, he surprised Nicole with the book. When he proposed, he had been working on a book that he was going to use to propose. And it was just kind of like a story about our journey to getting engaged, which was so beautiful. So we still have that book. The newlyweds couldn't wait to start a family, but there was a rocky road ahead. We both knew we wanted like a really big family. Um, and so once we got married, I think it was kind of like, you know, well, if it happens, it happens and we'll just start from there. And then nothing was really happening, which um, obviously became concerning. The couple moved across the country and sought the best IVF doctors. Facing the challenge without friends and family nearby, they relied on each other. There was a lot of low points physically and then emotionally and spiritually. And so like having to see her go through that for me was was pretty tough. But ultimately, the struggle was worth it, and Teddy's arrival was the perfect storybook ending. Teddy kind of represents uh, both of our journeys ever since the day we met, and so this book kind of encapsulates all of that, and it's just cool to be able to, you know, when he's older, to be able to read it to him, and hopefully he kind of understands, like, everything his mom went through to, to you know, bring him into this world.